how to create educational escape rooms, strategies for creation and design. The content of this work is composed by introduction, methodology, results and conclusion. Gamification is a technique that uses a strategy which builds on from elements that are attractive to games and that can contribute to the motivation and engagement of students in an educational environment. Specifically, educational escape rooms bring a creative learning atmosphere that can be designed for an educational level and use the characteristics of escape room design that will be incorporated into the specific aims and educational elements. Also, promotes the development of soft skills as active learning, communication, creativity and collaboration. So, what are these steps necessary to ensure quality, active learning and a positive experience for the student using escape rooms? The research sought to answer the following questions. How is the process of organization and creation of an educational escape rooms conducted? What are the main educational strategies before, during and after the activities of an escape room? In the methodology was here is a negative review of bibliography. We use examples of successful applications in different educational settings. The exploration of relationships between the documents shows three fundamental results. Creation, learning cycle and evaluation. In creation, it is necessary first Identify the target audience and the learning needs. After, identify the topics and skills to be developed and what the learning objectives will be. And then, develop your theme and puzzles. The theme must be engaging and tell a story, and puzzles must be compatible with the theme and objectives they finish. Finally, test all the puzzles and materials. Determine the time needed for the activity and he examine and refine all the instructions. The student's learning cycle follows some characteristics during the activity. This figure illustrates the student's learning cycle. The students explore for the activity to understand the flow of the game. We will need to remember some content, analyze and apply it to the game for the trio and hero until they find the solution. At the end of the game, Evaluation it is necessary. Analyze participants, your difficulties, frustrations and feelings about the experience. Having clear learning and skills development objectives, have an engaging narrative and development challenge and puzzles compatible with age and knowledge of participants is essential for the success of the escape room. So here are these two references. Thanks for listening.